Hello, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to see the code forces problem A that is Sasha and the beautiful array. Okay, so Sasha decided to give his girlfriend an array A1 to AN. Is he mad? <laughs> he has given his girlfriend an array. Wow, amazing. He found out that his Girlfriend evaluates the beauty of the array as the sum of the values ai minus ai minus 1 for all integers from i equal to 2 to n. Okay. So, <clears throat> Sasa help Sasa and tell him the maximum beauty of the array that he can obtain if he can rearrange its element in any way. This is a question we need to solve. So, let's see the first example. In the first example, we have 2, 1, 3. So, if this is the case, then if we do the sum, then first we will have minus 1. Again, we have 2. Okay, 3 minus 1, 2. So, total will be 1 here. And that is not maximum, right? You know that. That is not maximum. So, can we increase in some way? Let it be, we can try 3, 2, 1. But this will give minus 1 and minus 1. Again is the problem. This is minus 2 total. So it is not the maximum. We need maximum. So we need maximum. That means, that means the every element after that current element should be greater than the previous element. So let's suppose the smallest element we take from 2, 1, 3 is 1. We can put this element in the front. Then we took the second minimum and put it here. So we'll get 2 minus 1, 1. And again, the third minimum that is 3 here, we'll put here. So again 1. This will result 2. Okay. So, in next example, we have 59, 69 and 69. This is a great number. So, we need to calculate, we need to rearrange. Like, we can rearrange it in any way, but we can't change the order because numbers are same. So, obviously, the answer will be 0 here, no doubt. So let's see this case, the good case, that is, there is no good case, by the way, 3, 4, 3, 3, okay. So here, what is the difference? That is 1, here, minus 1, here, it is 0. So we can get maximum 0 in this case, but we can rearrange, obviously we can rearrange. And what we will do? We will rearrange in this order. 3, 3, 3, 3. Sorry. This one. So 0 here, 0 here, but 1 here. So 1 is the maximum possible. And that is your answer. 1. For this, you can have 1 and 2. Why? Just think about it. <clears throat> because we need this thing ai ai minus ai minus 1 when the sum of this is maximum so we can have if this is greater than 0 then the sum can be maximum for greater than 0 what we can do first element should be smaller than second and third like that, fourth, fifth, like that. This order should follow. And what is this order called? It is called a sorted array, obviously. This we need to do, sorted array. If we can do that, then we just simply need to do this thing and add the answer. That's it. That is the solution for this. Hope you understood this solution. So let's go to the code.
where we go to the code so we just need to take the input declare the vector take the input sort the vector declare the answer variable calculate and just print the answer that's it hope you understood this solution like this video subscribe the channel thank you and keep coding hello welcome back to our youtube channel today we are going to see the code process problem a that is sasa and the beautiful array okay so sasa decided to give his girlfriend an array a1 to an is he mad <laughs> he has given his girlfriend an array wow amazing he found out that his girlfriend evaluates the beauty of the array as the sum of the values ai minus ai minus 1 for all integers from i equal to 2 to n okay so <clears throat> sasa help sasa and tell him the maximum beauty of the array that he can obtain if he can rearrange its element in any way this is the question we need to solve so let's see the first example in the first example we have 2 1 3 so if this is the case then if we do the sum then first we'll have minus 1 again we have 2 okay 3 minus 1 2 so total will be 1 here and that is not maximum right you know that that is not maximum so can we increase in some way let it be we can try 3 2 1 but this will give minus 1 and minus 1 again is the problem this is minus 2 total so it is not the maximum we need maximum so we need maximum that means that means the every element after that current element should be greater than the previous element so like suppose the smallest element we take from 2 1 3 is 1 we can put this element in the front then we took the second minimum and put it here so we'll get 2 minus 1 1 and again the third minimum that is 3 here we will put here so again 1 this will result 2 okay so in next example we have 69 69 and 69 this is a great number so we need to calculate we need to rearrange like we can rearrange it in any way but we can't change the order because numbers are same so obviously the answer will be zero here no doubt so let's see this case the good case that is there is no good case by the way three four three three okay so here what is the difference that is one here minus 1 here it is 0 so we can get maximum 0 in this case but we can rearrange obviously we can rearrange and what we will do we will rearrange in this order 3 3 3 3 sorry this one so 0 here 0 here but 1 here so 1 is the maximum possible and that is your answer 1 for this you can have 1 and 2 why just think about it <clears throat> because we need this thing ai ai minus ai minus 1 when the sum of this is maximum so we can have if this is greater than 0 then the sum can be maximum for greater than 0 what we can do first element should be smaller than second and third like that fourth fifth like that this order should follow and what is this order called it is called sorted array obviously 
this we need to do sorted array if we can do that then we just simply need to do this thing and add the answer that's it that is the solution for this hope you understood this solution so let's go to the code so if we go to the code so we just need to take the input declare the vector take the input sort the vector declare the answer variable calculate and just print the answer that's it hope you understood this solution like this video subscribe the channel thank you and keep coding